Welcome back to another Smodic Blues Dope video today, guys. I'm Butcher Cater, and sorry for not posting for a little while. This actually took longer than it took to get my new laptop set up, so that's a, that's a bit weird, but I just really didn't want to make another video with, um, out my new mic set up because my last video just had complete, utter garbage audio, so hopefully this is better. I mean, well, it should be better. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and start a new game. Let's start from Freedom because of this loading screen this is literally insane you have the escape pod. like whoever did this like props to them man this is actually like really cool we now know the sh we now know what the ship looks like we like that like, that like that's the part that we like um get out of i don't know i stuttered there so much but whatever um just looks like it, it looks so good make a great desktop background and then let's go we're gonna go ahead and skip this intro because there's absolutely nothing new basically to it um, they are still putting in some of the, um, you know, voice lines and stuff, obviously. And then, um, I already made a video on that new character called Cal. And then we have this new, uh, cold emote. That immediately started when you start the game, which is actually kind of cool. So, let's go ahead and, um, check out some more emotes. So, this is one of the emotes right here. So, that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and check out this one over here with the heat plant. Um, let's see. Why is it not working? Worked for me before. Let's see. Let's just try this one. It'll work over here. Hmm. Usually, what happened is there's another emote where she's. Huh. That's interesting. Usually, there was an emote where she was rubbing her hands together to try to gain warmth. That's the one that I personally saw when I booted up my game, but whatever. Um, let's go ahead and check out the Marguerite Meadows greenhouse because they did some new lighting textures I know over there. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and go. Alright guys, and so then we're at Marguerite Meadows greenhouse and over here, um, they actually have this new symbol right here. So this shows that the door is locked. They did not have this before. So, um, that's kind of interesting. I'm assuming that's because we have to go get those other encounters from Marguerite Maiden and then this will be open. I'm assuming that's why. I'm not going to go ahead and do that because there's really nothing new over there. And um, we'll go ahead and cheat to get in there, but let's go ahead and pick up this abandoned PDA. Gardening tips, that's kind of interesting. And then let's go ahead and put it to creative. There we go. And now let's go ahead and ghost in and go check this out. So here is um, all of the lighting changes. Obviously there's so much more ivy in here um, and a bunch of rust details as well. So um, yeah, they're doing a really good job in here. And we have more of these things that was in her original house, which looks pretty good. So um yeah they're doing a great job in here alright guys then over here I'm assuming this is supposed to be the hydraulic fluid I already made a video on this but they have some new um, smoke visual effects for when the thing goes out so let's go ahead and try that I'm assuming this is the hydraulic fluid but it's not letting me pick it up so we're just gonna go ahead and spawn it in alright then that's in let's go ahead and extend the bridge there we go and um yeah personally this makes it a lot more cinematic for me I personally enjoy it so yeah I don't know I think that's a great addition that they made and um, also over here that we need to go over is the transfuser. So the transfuser, I'm pretty sure was in the first game, but for some reason, whenever there we go. Okay, I saw it for like a split second. Oh, this is the new emote for Hale, by the way, as well. And then for some reason, it's not wanting to. Whenever I look up, it seems to do it. It's not wanting to show the transfuser at all. But this is what the transfuser looks like in um. Here we go. The PDA, the transfuser. Congrats, translators. We made a game. Not sure what that means, but um, yeah. In the original game, I may be completely wrong about this, but I thought it was. There we go. So when we walk, it now shows it. There we go. Anyways, but I may be completely wrong about this, but I believe in the original game, you're actually able to combine the DNA of other creatures with some creatures. I know that was somewhere in the game. I thought that might be a mod, but I, I have no idea. So yeah, let's go ahead and um, check out the next update. Alright, guys, and then over here in the Ice Worm Arena, we now have these dead Ice Worm skeletons that have already been over here, but we now have. Um, this new dead ice worm, which looks really good in my opinion. It has like a blue tint, which really makes the effect that it's dead as well. Then, um, obviously this isn't like too gory, obviously, because I'm, this is, they're trying to keep it as PG as possible for pretty much all ages. So I'm assuming, I don't know if it's going to be the finished thing or not, but it looks pretty good in my opinion. So they're doing a great job on, um, adding more stuff to this graveyard. Alright guys, and then down here... We have, um, right where this tunnel used to lead, there is now this blocked ice wall. So, let me go ahead and get the laser cutter. I'm not sure if you can get it from this side or not. Alright guys, let's go ahead and see. 
I'm not, I don't think we can. Let's go ahead and see on the other side, maybe. I think we, you probably can. Let's go ahead and see. Yes, okay, you can. And then let's see what happens once this thing is fully cut. Alright, guys, we're almost there. And this thing is... It glitched out a lot right there. Um... Okay, that was like really bugged out. I believe it's supposed to fall inwards or out there, but that's interesting, I guess. Oh, there we go. Why is it acting? Okay, I don't know why that just happened, but it, 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 that, that did not seem like it was supposed to fall like that. Anyways, guys, let's go into the next update. Alright, guys, and I'm not sure if this is actually in the game yet or not, but let's go ahead and see. Static interference. There we go. It's finally in the game. Alright. I made this in like two videos ago, or maybe three, I can't really remember, but now it says static interference. Finally, it's actually in the game, so I'm not sure if that's because the satellite's still up, if that's something to do with like, I don't know, the sentry up there, but yeah, that's actually really cool. Alright guys, and then a really cool new um, go-to point that they have is warn, point of no return. I'm not sure where that goes to, like I, I, I legit just heard about this on Discord. I have no idea where this goes, so we're just going to go ahead, try it out, let's see uh, where it takes us. Alright guys, so I just typed it into the uh, little bar here, let's see where this takes us. If it does take us anywhere, where is this on the map? This is... I have no idea what's happening to the ground right now, but like... Oh, this is back to the... This is in the end game. Okay, yeah, they added new textures, all these things, it looks really wonky, this is not the finished texture whatsoever, this does not look anything like precursors in my opinion, so I really hope they change this, but um, so Warn of Point, Point of No Return has something to do with the end game. I guess it kind of sounded like that in the first place, I probably shouldn't have known that, but that's kind of cool actually, that's kind of interesting. Alright. Alright guys, and then the next thing that um, is supposed to happen, they said they, the sea monkeys now have reactions to flares, which, is my game bugged or something? Like, why won't it, I can see the flare, but like, what the heck is going, there we go, there we go, finally, alright. So let's go ahead and see if the sea monkey does something, I do not have a land in my head, so for all I know it might try to, that's weird. It tries, hello? That is weird, it's like swimming away from me almost. It clearly must not like the flare. Okay, um, I'm assuming, I've heard that p from people that have also done it with land in their head, it's not seeming to work, so I, this is, that, that's why the, I did a completely new game. So yeah, it doesn't seem to work here either. Maybe the reaction is them trying to swim away. That might be interesting. So anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed it up to this point, if you have, sure to smash that like button. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Ciao.